Oh, shiver me timbers. Shiver my timber. Um, how are we doing, everyone? I'm a little agitated. I'm a little stressed. Why is that? Well, in three hours' time, I'm going to London to fly to Boston for How Not to Travel America. Don't get me wrong, it's incredibly excited. I'm going to meet up with Greg out there, and it's going to be the biggest, baddest series the channel has ever had. Right now, though, I want to make two GeoGuessr videos because I don't want to leave you guys with nothing. I want you to have something to watch while I'm away. The issue is, um, I haven't got long to do it. So what it's going to be is two play along videos that I'm going to leave you. Similar maps to what we're used to, um, but I won't be able to play it at the same pace that I usually do, where I take time and use my detective skills and scour the map and all of that sort of stuff. Um, no, it's going to be more of a quick effect. In fact, why don't we just do three minutes per round? Because that way, there's a definite ceiling to the time I can spend searching, and it's the same for you. Because you're going to play along, right? Yeah, that's a good idea. Sorry, I've got the itchiest nose. Let's do this. Let's make a URL. You're going to play along. I'm going to do this map. And I'm going to do Urban World. Have I got time for this? Really? Still got to pack my bag. Jesus. If you watch How Not to Travel America and I've left my passport, this is why. Here we go. I don't know how this is... This might be shit. This might be really unenjoyable for you. First one. Oh, I've, have I just gone no moving, panning or zooming? I have. I can't do that. I can't do that, man. Oh, my God. Right. No move. Is that right? So I can move. No. I haven't. Oh, I don't know what this any of this is. So I can pan and I can zoom, yeah? Oh fuck, I didn't do the challenge link. Mate, you are missing this flight. You are missing this flight. Right, here we go. Challenge, pan, zoom, three minutes. Copy that, boom. Here we are. Here's our first capital city and, well, there we go. I was just about to say, I wonder if I can get this without moving, um, without even having to use the move. But I think that's almost entirely possible because I looked to the left and there I saw Andorra, the tiny country that will easily give away this, um, this answer. I mean, I think we can get this spot on because small country, small capital. Uh, it's Andorra La Vela, isn't it? Yeah, so we'll be... I mean, I will move. Shall I move? I'm tempted not to. I'm tempted just to be stubborn and not. Calcats Albert. Albert. Yeah, we've... Let's have a look here. Let's have a look. I mean, we've still got two minutes. I'm trying to record this video, by the way, with no cuts, no edits, no, uh, you know, if I fluff a line or I'm searching for... If there's, a, if there's silence for too long, I'll usually cut it up these days, but I'm just going to try and literally not have to edit this video whatsoever. So it, it might seem a bit weird. Are we there? Look, there's a hotel. Andorra Centre. Yeah. Hotel Best Andorra Centre. So, and you can see the shape of that building there is... Perfect, yeah, Calcats Albert, we've got it. Cool Cats Albert is what I would call it, but that's just me. Um, there we go, we can guess that with a minute to spare. Wow, Heathrow, here I come. 5,000 points. What a cracking way to start. Didn't even need the full three minutes. Didn't even need to move. Oh, God, I'm good. <laughs> I only said that because I just know I'm going to mess up. Um, big time on one of these rounds uh, because it's going to be hard to do this in three minutes. To, to get a perfect score, I'll be very, very proud of that. Anyway, should probably stop waffling. That 
is an Angola flag. Oh, yes, it is. The Angola flag is one of my favourite flags, I think. Um, because I used to have a flag book when I was a kid. And it would be Antigua and Barbuda. It would be one of the first ones. Afghanistan would be one of the first. But Angola, I always thought, oh, what is that? That's an interesting logo. Still don't know what it means. Let me know in the comments, Angolans. Um, a perfect score is kind of... The more I ramble on, the more that that's going to slip out, out of my fingertips. But we're in a castle. So we're in Luanda. This is a big... Are we there? Fortaleza. Oh my God. I've just zoomed in to the kind of place you know, near the sea where you'd get a fort. And then I saw that, Fortaleza de São Miguel. I forgot that they speak Portuguese. That is the sea, isn't it? I thought that was some sort of um, white roof thing. Yeah, we are here because you can see the shape of the castle coming out. So we're definitely there. And I've got time to spare again to check if we're recording. And we are. Oh, God, what am I doing? We're recording. That's just amazing. What a day. Um, I'm, I'm going there, guys. Nine yards. Wow. Okay. Granted, two fairly easy rounds there. And you're going to have to watch me drink my water because I'm not editing it out. Uh. Um, yeah, two fairly easy rounds, it has to be said. Some of the rounds you've seen me have before have been nigh on impossible to, to get in any time. However, um, oh, what was I going to say? See, these are the moments you're going to have to put up with. Is this good content? Is this, is this worse than no content? Hopefully not. Um, I can't remember what I was going to say. Fuck it. Right, next one. I was going to make a point about... The score, what score am I trying to get? Don't know, but I'll, I'll be very pleased with the perfect score. Right, here we go, third round. Something Rimos Contigo. So this could be harder because we've got Spanish writing. <gasps> we've got, we're driving on the right. Um, hmm, doesn't look, oh, hang on, let me look around. Okay, this, oh, is this Chile, Argentina? There's the sun in the north slightly. Look, if you look there, line it up with the compass. So, Argentina, but we're in a capital, remember? So could it be Uruguay? This is capitals of the world, in case you didn't know. So I'm now looking for a flag or something. I mean, many of you will know, you'll know from the, the cars that, I don't know, you'll know from something, this sort of stuff, what country this is. Hippodroma, center, sausages, something about sausages. These, I mean, that, that will be a big giveaway for many of you. Don't think we can be in Hang on a minute, but we can't be in Peru. We can't be in Lima, surely. Oh my God, is that a mountain? Oh, I'm so confused. Is that a mountain or is that a cloud? Got a minute left now. I cannot see me pulling this one out of the bag. Definitely not a perfect score. That is out of the question, eh? That is a Peruvian flat, uh, kit, isn't it? Right, okay, hang on a minute. So we would be in a nice area of Lima then. Well, really? Where's the nice area? Of, I'm sure there's many, but it just doesn't seem like Peru. No, we can't be, no. No, I'm going to Buenos Aires.
I'm going to Buenos Aires. I just, isn't that a river plate shirt? What am I on about? I don't know where I'm going in when I say this. We're obviously not really near the centre. Oh, oh, Tom. It was Uruguay. Montevideo. I tell you what, that's not a bad switch. <laughs> that is not a bad switch. Why I was thinking Lima, I do not know. I'm so sorry. It's just the stress of, you know, packing my... I've still got to pack. Um, did I mention that earlier? But that's a good switch from Lima to Buenos Aires, which just so happens to be uh, 137 miles away from Montevideo. Didn't know that. I bet it's quite easy to get a ferry, isn't it? From one to the other. Anyway, moving on. So far, no cuts, no edits in the video. And we're back in what has to be Europe. That is so Europe. Is that Switzerland? Let's have a look. No, that is not Switzerland. That is Sweden, I reckon. Maria Preistgardsgata. Can that be Sweden? Sure, it can be Sweden. Let's just have a look upwards. We've got time. Three, three minutes is it's a decent old lick of time. You really can... Chill out a bit. Two minutes is... Yeah, it makes all the difference. From two minutes. Um, I imagine... Right, I'll tell you how we can rule out Norway. Oh, there's a yellow number plate. What is that? Is that just a Dutch person? Roaming the land? Roaming Europe? Willy-nilly? Definitely, we're definitely in Scandinavia though, aren't we? Let me just, ah, look at that. That's right there. Dot, is that a DK? Starting to think now that we could be in Denmark. Oh, God. All right, well, again, they border each other, so if I'm wrong, I can't be too wrong. But I am going to go Copenhagen. Let's have a look in here. Fat, fat Burr's Brunnen. Where's that? That's where I'm aiming for, with 40, 49 seconds left. Where's... Fatbers Brunnen, how do I find that? That's like the district. Not the meat packing district. Alright, maybe I look for this road then. Maria's something. Maria's Prast Garden. Don't worry, I'm gonna just click. Let's have a look at the direction of the road. With 20 seconds left. It's going pretty much from east to west. I'm not going to get it. Around here, maybe? I might as well change my guess. You knobhead! You absolute... Why did I think it was Denmark? I thought I saw a DK. Oh! Oh, that's hard to take. Because the number plates in Denmark are, are slightly different. This is all... Guys, you, you, those of you who are good at GeoGuessr, you're going to have to just bear in mind that I literally haven't played in months. Um, yeah, the number plates in Denmark, they do have... No, I'm thinking of the signposts that have the red around it. Oh, whatever. Let me know. Remind me, are the number plates slightly different in Denmark? Anyway, fifth round. The score isn't bad. I Okay. This is Bangladesh, anyway, for the last one. So Dakar. Uh, it's got to be, hasn't it? Hotel Wall City. Let me just confirm. 
I think it's someone called Annette has taken this. Here's Annette. There she is. Fair play. How are your nails looking, Annette? A little bit misshapen. And she's riding with this guy. A local, I think. A local tour guide. Um, Crockery Palace. So, I think we're in Dakar. That you do in, in India you do get this same language but I don't think that would be in New Delhi so without any further ado as we approach the midway point I'm gonna try and restore some I'm not gonna find it in Europe I'm not gonna find some uh, dignity in Europe let's get into Dakar and just see if we can restore something here with a cracking guess. Wall City, look, Fort, Lalbag Fort. Sorry, all I'm thinking of is curry now because there's a Lalbag curry in my hometown. This looks more touristy, you know, more likely to get a hotel. So far, the scores haven't been too bad. We weren't punished too much. Even with that shoddy, shoddy last round. Lal bag. No, that's just curry again. Um, so what's that? The Wall Hotel. The Hotel Wall City. I would laugh if we're not in Dakar. I really would. I'd cry as well, but... New Gulshan Cinema Hall. I'm going to click here just for now. It's the similar... Thing is, last time. Wall City, Farm Gate. We're not gonna. No, 20 seconds left. We'll be in Dakar, but we'll be the other side of town. I just know it. I just know it. I'm getting my hopes way down. Here we go. This is it. I haven't moved my, my pin. I'm leaving it. You. I don't believe that, man. I don't... 1,485 points. I was wrong about... It's not even... See, the Indians... The Indians... The Indians amongst you and the Bangladeshis and probably a great deal more people will point out I'm sure you'll be very quick to point out that those, that writing, that script, that, that text is not the same and that it's different. I mean, I can see it from here. It's, it's got similarities because it's mainly a line on top, but I had a fear, I had a niggling feeling that that wouldn't be Bangladesh. Why though? Why? Good question. The Western tourist, um, a lot of English writing, maybe more than you'd get in Bangladesh, I don't know. But that has brought my score right down. We started so well. That literally went, that was like an exponential graph, wasn't it? We started perfect, then we were 137 miles away, then we were, I don't know, 700 miles away, and then... At the end there, we were over a thousand miles away. It just crumbled. Well, I'm used to that, watching the England football team. Uh, guys, thanks for playing along. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that vid video, which, didn't, which had mistakes in it, because I didn't edit them out. Um, let me know what you thought of that vibe, because I can, I can do these more often, because they don't take as much time, basically. So yeah, um, thanks for tuning in. Did I just say that? Uh, I'm going to make the worst thumbnail for this. You wait. It's going gonna, it's gonna to get no views, this video. Right, uh, tune in for the next one. I don't know what order I'm going to release these, uh, but 
I'll see you when I'm back from the States. And uh, until then, take care.